Hey yo everybody, welcome back to Book the Rangers. So we are continuing from last episode, obviously. Fucking I don't know why I said that. Uh there's somebody I wanna talk to. There he is. The blacksmith. We can make our uh U wood armor now. Which I don't know if it's an upgrade or not, but whatever. It's better than wearing the same armor over and over again. Hey, I added in a new mod. And we're gonna check it out in a little bit here. This thing is almost full. I should probably start combining the crafting stations. But uh, let's make this U wood stuff. Boom. Helmet. Bam. Boom. Chest plate. Bam. Boom. Legs. Bam. Our defense went down. Uh, but our damage. 16 range damage. I think our damage went up. Yes. Okay. Sweet. That's all we're looking for. And the set bonus. After four non critical strikes, your next range attack will mini crit for 150% damage. That is pretty good. It's not bad. All right. Uh, we're not gonna keep armors. Sell them. No point in keeping them. Is this a material? No. No point in keeping it. Get rid of it. We don't need it. But uh, who else is here? We got this guy. Can I make? Let me see something here. We have uh, Reginald here too. Can I make ammo? Musket? Whatever the hell they're called. No, I can't can't make the pouch you need crystal ball for that okay understandable uh well we have a musket in our inventory so it'd probably be smart if we bought musket ammo good couple hundred should do us some good there you go so i have a list here i went through a bunch of comments through like the last three episodes and we're gonna start off with uh this list we're gonna start off with the top thing with this list that i've been just you know grabbing suggestions from uh paint gun a lot of people want me to get the paint gun. I've used it before. I know how to get it. You guys don't have to keep on telling me how to get it. It's just... It's a good weapon. But... I'm not... Do I really want to use it? Not really. I feel like there's a lot of other weapons, you know, that are not part of vanilla. If you want to see me use this gun a lot, you can go watch my uh, OG Fisherman playthrough. That's where I use this gun a lot. Where the hell is he? See you later, man. Use the Tome of Manipulation. Uh, shout out to Juice. But here's the paint gun. It's a pretty good one. Don't get me wrong. But like like I said, I've used it before. Nothing crazy. We're going to do some uh, some weapon switching here. All right. I think we're going to get rid of the dart gun. As useful as it was. I think we're going to get rid of it. And then I think we're going to get rid of... I don't know. I think everything else will keep right now. But hold up. There's still more we're crafting. Somebody suggested that I make the Pumpler, which is from Calamity. Uh, pumpkin seeds, pumpkin, and illegal gun parts. Uh, I think I need seeds. Well, she sells seeds. Hello. One, two, three, four, five. Five. Oh, might as well buy an extra and plant it. Boom. I jump high. There you go. And then let's deposit that. And can we make the Pumpler? Yes, we can. So they told me like the Pumpler with Meteor Bullets is really good. So we'll look into that. Well, let's see. Okay, it's really fast. Holy shit. Um, I don't know what to get rid of. <laughs> make, our, make our inventory bigger. I don't know. Let me do this. Okay. We don't need this Emerald Net. Now that I think about it. That over there. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Just keep the tome in there. I, whatever. Uh, moving on. Soul stones. Somebody told me about soul stones a couple episodes ago. So let me look at this. Uh, soul space stone. Soul stone. So is the souls of powerful fallen creatures and otherworldly entities seem to have some have sealed some of its power. So, so soul is not bound. Craft one of the class stones to bind it. Class stone. Okay. Stone? Let me just type in stone. What the fuck's a class stone? Soul stone. That's from Thorin. That's not what we're looking for. Oh, here we go. Assassin. Okay. Throwing. Range. So I think it's the hunter stone. Sharpshooter. Range and damage. Yes, that's what we want. We want range and damage. Let me look through the rest. I gotta sneeze. <laughs> okay, so infuse your soul with the essence of sharpshooter. Ranged and damage focus. Right click to bind your soul. You need an alchemical confuser. 
And the rest of the stuff is easy to get. What the hell is an alchemical confuser? Infuser. What was it? Yeah, infuser. Uh, this. So we need bottles, glass, and torches. Easy. Easy. I don't remember how much glass. Just make a bunch. Okay, there you go. And then it was four torches. One, two, three, four. Boom. Infuser. Fuck, what? What is that? Crystalline infuser. What am I missing? I don't, I'm missing wood, really? Okay. Just put like 10 wood in there. You never know if I ever need wood for something else. Let's try this again. Boom, infuser. What the fuck? What am I missing now? Oh, I need a logical workbench. It's so weird how this mod has a different name than what it, what it's called now. What the fuck is it? I spelled it wrong. Okay. Logical work. Oh my god. All right. After that long crafting montage, there was an, a montage. Uh, we're gonna make what was it? Sharpshooter? Stop. Soul? Stop? Something? Boom. And then right click to bind your soul. Your soul has been bound to the soul stone. So now I have to make a soul stone. Uh, I really don't know how this works. What is that? What is that? Uh, tsh, this. We need a mana star. Got it. Got it. Mana crystal. Boom. Now we should be able to make this soul stone. Boom. Okay. No idea. Friendly eyes spawn to protect you when you're taking damage. Inflicts. Attacks inflict slime. I don't know what any of this shit does. Uh, maybe we get rid of this. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Boom. So we now have our soul stone active. I am ready to murder. That sounds bad. Okay. Is there anyone else I need to talk to? Do I need to reforge? Nah. Mm, the pumpler, maybe. Speak about the pumpler. I need to go get that meteorite. Or mine the meteorite. No, oh, thank you. Give me something crazy. Yeah, that works. Nimble. Probably don't want nimble on that. Yeah, that works. Make sure everything at least has damage. That's fine. Okay, so we're gonna go take on some bosses, of course. What else would I do? Hive mine. Easy. That should be a breeze. Actually, I don't know. I kind of kind of got to reforge everything. All right, we're going to do another jump cut here. I'm going to reforge a bunch of stuff, try and get some potions, and we're going to go take on the high mine. All right, I'm really hoping we can do this. I don't remember how tough this boss is. I also have the other boss, so let, let's let's do it. I don't know what that shit is. Oh, I think it's the you would buff. Yeah, it is. Let's do it. Paint and ball gun only, because this is what everyone wants to see, is me using this gun. So I'll show you me using this gun. It's really good. I really liked it when I did the original fishing playthrough. And then I think there's an upgrade for it. Dude, this is bad. That was pretty fucking bad. <laughs> it's taking a lot of damage right there. Am I getting life steal? I don't know. I can't tell. I don't know really what's going on. If I'm being honest, it's really dark. <laughs> is this the best weapon I could be using? Probably not. Are we even getting health back? I hope so. Is there a second form? I don't remember. I think I, actually we fought the hive mind a lot more than we fought the uh, perforator as of recent. I think I don't know. I don't remember the last time I fought the perforator. Especially since the perforator is different now. Dude, fuck the fuck that stuff. Especially since the perforator is different now. Like, I don't remember the last time we fought the perforator definitely before the sprite change the boss itself has changed a bunch too so i don't really remember it's ai the last time we fought but this is not too bad I remember these bosses being decently hard maybe the perforator is harder i don't know i'm getting my cheeks clapping stop that all right boom that boss is dead i keep running into that cloud okay snow biome stir left we're gonna grab this heart i keep on trying to shoot these eyeballs they're mine Grab this heart. We're gonna go snow biome. We're gonna fight Hypothema, aka the boss in the thumbnail. It should be the boss in the thumbnail. I don't know. We'll see. Hypothema is from Enigma, which is a pretty good mod. The short time I've played it, played a little bit in the uh, what the fuck playthrough was it? The uh, stream playthrough that doesn't really get streamed at all. I'm sorry. I've been playing a lot of Fallout 76, guys. I'm being irresponsible. 
Y'all don't know how fast days have been passing playing Fallout 76. It's bad. It's all kinds of bad. Um, like, I woke up the other day. I woke up early the other day. I woke up like 9, 10. And the day went back. The day went by. It was like 2 a.m. before I knew it. In like the span of like an hour. But it felt like an hour. Playing Fallout the whole time. Let's do it. Hypothema. Wait, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Chill out. Okay. Uh, let's use the bow. I don't know. I'm trying to, I'm trying to use different weaponry. Maybe the pump with. Ooh. Getting them hits in there. Getting them hits. I'm getting in there. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to be dodging right now. Wait. Don't I have. Oh, I have a counter scarf. I was wondering why I kept on taking damage every time. This ain't good. I, have, I don't remember fighting Hypothema, but I. I don't remember the whole fight with Hypothema. I know Hypothema hits hard, though. What I remember about this boss. How hard it hit. As you can see, I'm suffering. We're taking some damage right now. This is not bad damage. Oh my god, I keep trying to dodge into it. No, oh, Wayne, no. Do you see how she's cutting? Oh my god, we might die. I don't even know what the fuck killed me. I don't even think I got hit. That was just all kinds of bad. She did this thing where there would be the icicle. And then if the little, like, fucking four-sided icicle wasn't chasing me, she would cover up the gap in which I can dodge. She did that, like, three times in a row. That made that extremely hard. Uh, we'll fight her again. Don't worry. Hopefully I have enough to fight her. But, let's see here. We got this. True shadow scale. These things got respited for, like, the eighth time. I don't know, actually. Uh, same thing. This is a shade thrower. Oh! I hold up. I have a mod in here. I think we'll take a look at this mod next episode. We might have like the whole episode dedicated to this mod. But I have a mod in here. Fuck, I passed it. Because it's called NEF. Instead of not enough flamethrowers. But I still should have been slower. We have not enough flamethrowers in here. Adds in a bunch of flamethrowers. Really cool. Uh, we'll check it out in the next episode, like I said. But let's take a look here. This. We can make the amalgamated brain. Uh... Can I make the brain of confusion? I might be able to. Yeah, I can. Uh, but we need a worm scarf. Yeah, I mean, might as well. What is what is this anyways? What is, what's the revengeance drop? Is this the revengeance drop? Look, there's no revengeance drop for this boss. Uh, so what does this do? 10% increased damage, 12 percent increased critical strike chance, shade rains. Pretty good. It's pretty good, pretty much. Mithril Anvil. Are you putting cheeks together and going like this? <laughs> no, let's have a nice, quick little King Slime fight. This is actually really good. We get to test out the Shade Thrower. And also, oh my god, look at that. That activates the mini crit every single time. Did I do 4,000 right there? Or is that just numbers lining up? We're getting, we're getting a lot of gel. We're using a lot of gel. But I think we're going to end up with more than we use. Uh, let's go ahead and just use the paintball gun then. Don't want to waste too much gel. I still need to bind keys for my rage and adrenaline. Forget about that, because, you know, I haven't played death mode. Or, not death mode. I haven't played Revengeance since that multiplayer playthrough. That was a long time ago. Uh, but this is really good. This is a blessing in disguise, especially since I just talked about not enough flamethrowers. And we're going to need a, enough gel. Right now, we don't have enough gel. Not enough gel, currently. But that's gonna help. You see these banners? We're gonna flip that into a profit. Beautiful. Okay. Boom. Open that up. Just fucking sell it. I don't know. We probably need. Let me hold on to those. Uh, ammo crate. I don't need drug darts. Slime gun. Don't really need that. Boom. Put that all. Put all that in there. And then we're gonna go over here. And we're gonna see if we are missing. And yep, we're missing the chest plate. Alright, that's what I expected was us missing the chest plate. So we can sell this. But yeah, we're gonna take these banners right here and we're gonna flip them into a profit. Maybe like, how are you flipping them into a profit? You type in gel, you could break banners down into gel. Of course, I don't have the solidifier in here because I'm fucking stupid. So we're gonna take the banners out and we're gonna bring them back over here. Now, these things give you a good bit of gel too. Like, look at this. I just got 150 gel for that. What, it only takes 50 to get a banner? So you pretty much get 50 back, and then for the other banner, you also get 50 more, so you're profiting. 
yeah, I gotta go find some day blooms or some sort of potion because I know we ain't gonna fight Hypothema with my thoughts and prayers. We 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 need to fight her with some defense. That's the only way we gonna we gonna make this easy. I also need to make a better arena. So I'll be right back. All right, this time we are destroying Hypothema. And that's facts. No printer. Let's do it. We're gonna get you down straight up. It's going down. Hopefully, Hypothema doesn't hit me with that good, good strat. That little icicle and then covering the gap that I can dodge. I can't really do much there. Uh, oh, she almost got me right there. They home in a little bit. I can't tell if they home in a little bit or if they're just their projectile that slowly goes downwards. They look like they home in a little bit. They look like they do a little bit. I don't even know what the fuck is hitting me. Oh, it's that stupid thing. So you gotta keep moving during this fight. That little, the little ice shuriken gets on you. Okay, we doing good, we doing good. We are going through a lot of ammo here. The pumpler definitely goes through a lot of ammo. This feels like a, a donator weapon. We did it. I knew it was going down. Easy. No problem. I just kind of, I was just playing bad the first fight. But we did it. What's that? At least the ice shards when struck. Oh my god, you know how many items I can have like that? <laughs> I can just have explosions when I get hit by something. There'll be ice, there'll be lightning. What was the other one? Fire or something? I can have so many. Oh, fuck. I put the accessory that the, or the item she dropped in here. But yeah, I can have just explosions of stuff. Let me see. Where are the accessories? So it's this one. Frost Essence. The Amadeus Spark. And there was another one. I remember the other one. Equipables? Where's Equipables? Equipment. I don't remember what the other one was. Oh, it was this one. The spores. <laughs> I could just straight up explode. But, uh, what would she drop? She dropped some sort of crafting item. It was icy. It looked like snowflakes. I don't know. She dropped something. I'm sorry. Can you guys hear a car horn? I can hear a car horn. Um, misc? Can probably be the easiest way to find it. I don't know. I'm not seeing it. I gotta. Oh, God. I, don't, I really don't want to. Oh, there it is. No, it's not chilled leaves. Dude, I have no idea. Is it an ore? Placeables? I have no fucking clue. What, what was it? All right, I figured it out. Don't worry about that. I kept on hitting the wrong key. But I figured it out. It was frost shard. I swear she dropped like a stack or something. I don't know. Uh, That don't matter. Is it a ranged weapon? Frost cannon? Interesting. Extremely interesting. This armor doesn't look bad, so we might get it. I don't know. That means we got to fight it again. But one more thing before we end off this episode. I know I didn't mind the meteorites because there's no demolition stuff spawning. I don't really want to do it unless there's a demo. We're going to do this, okay? And we're going to get hit by something and just see what happens. What beauty, what kind of beautiful thing happens when I get hit with all of these accessories on that, you know, send out damage when I get hit. I'm about to see right here. Oh my god. <laughs> there's lightning, there's spore clouds, there's ice shurikens, and there's. Oh my god. And there's fucking eyeballs. What is this? Do a pacifist run like this. I might do a challenge like this, man. Fight a boss by only taking damage? Like, come on. That sounds interesting. Hit me. Hit me with your best shot. Oh my. That's pretty good, man. I might have to write this down for the challenge series. You know, we do that all the time. Yeah, I'm like, we don't do challenge series. I don't remember the last time we did the challenge series. But look at this. This is cool. Let me zoom in a little bit. Let me get it all in its beauty. Ooh. Ooh. 